The cost of production as well as policies and regulations are some of the major factors that significantly affect the manufacturing sector in Kenya. The sector's growth rate, which stood at 8.4% in 2017, is expected to grow to 15% by the year 2022. To achieve this, manufacturers are calling on the government to streamline the business environment to boost competitiveness of the industry on the global market. We benchmark globally. Earlier on, we were talking about things like VAT refunds. What's the global best practice? If you are uh, straining local businesses from uh, having cash flows, that is going to become an issue for them globally, um, being competitive globally. He says the small medium enterprises are the major drivers of the manufacturing sector and more focus should be extended to them. All these things that we are going to do are going to be through SMEs. Any country that has grown its manufacturing or even all the big manufacturers, they start as SMEs. And we must support them, build the infrastructure around them that helps them to grow. There's a lot of focus on supporting uh, SMEs and there's been, I mean, it's not just a conference that has been held uh, Shiro, there's actually active work uh, on the field with creating manufacturing uh, capabilities and manufacturing uh, spaces uh, for SMEs, whether working with our micro and small enterprises sector, with the Kenya industrial uh, estates. Investment and Industry Principal Secretary Betty Miner says the government will soon announce an energy rebate formula in which the cost of electricity for optimum production will be outlined for manufacturers in the country. We have received the feedback about how we can structure uh, these contracts in a way that makes it uh, less expensive, no unit cost-wise. But even as we fix that, we're obviously looking at ensuring that there can be benefits for manufacturers. So, I mean, government will soon be announcing, the Minister for Finance will be soon, soon be announcing the formula for energy, uh, for energy rebates. Among some of the manufacturing priority agenda that stakeholders are looking to contribute this year, includes job creation, increase of the value and volume of exports, and enhancing market access for SMEs. Brian Itava, Channel One Business.